Hey everyone! Today we'll be trying no glue slime recipes. We'll be trying three different recipes today. We're gonna use ingredients like toothpaste, dish soap, cornstarch, and more. For the first recipe, all you'll need is cornstarch and dish soap. You will also need a small bowl, measuring spoons, and just a spoon to mix. Start off by adding two tablespoons of cornstarch. I decided to double this recipe because if I didn't, it was just going to be very small and there would be very little slime. So instead, we'll be using four tablespoons. Now, we're going to add one and a half tablespoons of dish soap. If you decide to double the recipe like me, then you're going to use three tablespoons of dish soap. Now, let's mix. After combining both ingredients, my slime was still very sticky and not the consistency I wanted it to be. So, we'll be adding some more cornstarch to solidify the slime. If your slime is too crumbly, then you can also add more dish soap. Now that my slime is the consistency I want it to be, the recipe says to let it sit for two minutes after stirring. After two minutes, the slime was ready. This slime was really soft. It sort of had the consistency of Play-Doh, and it didn't really stretch too well. didn't stick too bad to my hands, which I was actually surprised about, but when you put it to the table, there was a lot of residue left over. I give this recipe a 7 out of 10. The next recipe calls for hand cream, toothpaste, and baby oil. You also still need a bowl, measuring spoons, and a mixing spoon. Start off by adding 2 tablespoons of toothpaste. The recipe now says to microwave the toothpaste for 10 second intervals. I don't have a good feeling about this. The first time I took it out, it barely changed at all, so I put it in for a few more times. After seeing no change at all, the fifth time we took it out, it exploded. I decided that meant I should probably take it out and added three tablespoons of moisturizer. The recipe did ask for two to four tablespoons of moisturizer, so I just went for the middle. Now I'll take my baby oil and add one teaspoon. Let's mix. When I was done mixing, it was still really watery, and it was nothing like slime. So I went in and added a bit of cornstarch because I knew from last recipe that that helped to solidify the slime. After adding cornstarch, it was a really similar texture to the first one. It stuck to the table a bit, but it was really fun to poke and squish. This slime was also kind of hard to stretch like the last one, but still fun to poke. Without adding the cornstarch, this slime would have been a fail, so I'll give it a 4 out of 10. 
For this last line, you'll need mixing spoons, shaving cream, shampoo, and salt. Start off by adding 4 tablespoons of shampoo into your bowl. Then, you will need 4 tablespoons of shaving cream. We will lastly add 2 teaspoons of salt. Now we're going to mix. Once everything's combined, we're going to put it in the freezer. The recipe said 15 minutes, but we ended up putting it in for about 45. When we took it out, this is what it looked like. It definitely did not look or feel like slime. There were a few ice particles but it really did not change at all. It was just very cold. This one was a fail, and I give it a 2 out of 10. Bye everyone!